Alright, I'm gonna stop reading that. <laughs> uh, where is my Twitch chat window? There we go. Oh, that's no good. Perfect, okay. Um, leave it right there. This window, stay over here. And yeah, that's all I need. Perfect. Oh, I need sound too. Oh, never mind. Sound is on. This game just has not, does not have sound on the title screen. Okay, anyway, enough of that. Uh, yeah. Starting late today, so I'm actually going to split this into two streams. Originally, I was just going to play Clock Tower and D back to back. Uh, but, uh, yeah, then, uh, I had a plumbing issue, so <laughs> had to take care of that. House stuff, etc., etc. No one cares. Whatever. Uh, let's, uh, let's do this. Clock Tower. Original. The SNES. Off my hair. Just getting in the way. Raised in the Granite Orphanage. Jennifer and her friends were wanted... <laughs> what? Were wanted as adopted daughters. They were on the lam. It happened in September. So I'll take a look at the sound as well. So everything's balanced. Good so far. Very quiet game. Laura, hurry up. We want to be there before sunset. Couldn't hurt from a boost though. That'll work. Miss Mary? Yes? From now on, what kind of place will we be living in? That's the fifth time you've asked. Don't worry. It's a very nice place. We're almost there. See? But it's not going to be a nice place at all. That is a pretty nice place. I take it back. What a huge place. Main hall is gigantic. Everyone wait here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Missed a line. Whatever. Let's, um, oh. Way to run. Oh, if you double tap, you go faster. Stop button. What the hell? Did that button do? Okay, whatever. Do I talk to them? Okay. Hey, Anne. I want to know what kind of guy... Mr. Barrows is, right? Yeah. <laughs> you get no answer. <laughs> okay. Fine, Anne. What is it? Is something wrong? This mic is wrong. Let me get this down here. I'm hiding my face so much. This house makes me uneasy. this Chad-like figure over here have to say? I doubt I'll ever get used to this place. Huh? Ron Weasley. Heh. <laughs> Lottie's paranoid. Dot, dot, dot. Wait, where did she go? There's no door. Oh, there is a door. <laughs> How do I how do I enter door? Maybe I can't. Okay. 
<clears throat> I swear there's a way to run. I've seen a very small amount of footage from this game. Pretty sure it's possible. Can I go in this door? Oh shit. Locked. Getting there. So this door is very clearly open. Oh wait, there we go. Harry, she's taking a long time. Should I go find Miss Mary? No, I'll go. That John Carpenter-esque soundtrack kicking in. Main hall. Casually saunter over there. Girls? Come on, this isn't funny. The light switch is right here, right? Oh, I'm not actually, like, locked into position while we're talking. Neat. I should have looked at the controls before I started this. <laughs> there we go. Oh, how did I do that? Wait. Oh, triple tap? Huh? Locked. Oh, right. Go. Go, Mary. It only works some of the time. <laughs> On. <laughs> Let's go. Now I should be able to run. Can I not go this way? It's not. Oh shit. Well, that's the problem. Their side's too far away. Okay. So I need some boards for that. Down the stairs we go. Oh wait, no, I'm gonna try to get in this corner one more time. Dude, she's jamming out. <laughs> Did my profile change? That's a bit odd. Hm. Oh no, use the stairs. <laughs> Damn it, Mary. Why do I try to keep going in this door? <laughs> well, maybe I don't have to be in here. Okay. 
Oh, maybe it goes to like where your cursor's at. That might be why she keeps turning around in the middle of the hallway. Lights are out. Is the switch. Could it be here? About this television switch. Looks like it's broken. Okay. What are you doing? Touch the box. There's a key in here. Ooh, nice. Pocketed the West Wing key. Okay. Sure, I'll use that eventually. I don't see a light switch in here. Oh, wait, there's one right here. Ah. Pretty cool effect. There's nothing to say about that painting. The big old skull painting over here. This is fine. It's completely dark outside. What time is it now? Maybe I shouldn't have that TV on. So... I think that mirror can kill you. One of the few things I know about this game. I'm not gonna mess with it. It's like the uh, left bed isn't used. I'm gonna mess with this photo though. What is this thing? Photo. Small bottle of perfume. Yo, Knight, what's up? And jump back from clock, po clock tower to clock tower 3 graphics. Oh, yeah. I mean, uh, there's also clock tower, like, 1 for the PS1. Uh, that's a pretty cool midpoint. I don't know anything about clock tower 2. No, the, the, the bird. Oh man. Well, onward we go. I think all four games have nothing to do with each other, though. <laughs> oh shit. He's explaining. Well, that. That's concerning. Might not end well. <laughs> Is behind my head again. What the hell? I adjusted this. Oh, I know what happened. Can I pause? Okay, good. That pauses. Sorry, I forgot to switch layouts. Or, well, the game I was playing um, last stream, uh, the aspect ratio was like some other variant that's not 2 3. Or, no, uh, fucking 4 3. <laughs> So I had to make another uh, source for chat. Oh, did I put this? Oh, there we go. Bada bing, bada boom. What? It's also still out of frame. There. Now you guys are safe. <laughs> anyway, looks like we just found our first corpse. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, uh, <laughs> Lao? <laughs> Bra? <laughs> what? What? Oh shit! Am I dead? I'm not dead. Run! <laughs> gonna get us. Fucking go! Are you shitting me? <laughs> yeah, just fucking, you know, casually. 
Can't believe I found someone streaming this. Nice. What's up? Uh, Sl Slush Raptor. This is my first time playing it too. I, I know a little bit about it, but not very much. Okay, I'm not gonna go in a room because it's probably a dead end. No, stop going in here. <laughs> That's the wonderful thing of Twitch. Like whatever you want to watch, like usually there's something. Oh, this is this room. Good. Usually there's someone streaming it. <laughs> oh, I'm definitely playing the PS1 version. Um, so I'm doing like a, a bit of a marathon thing this month uh, where I'm playing a bunch of old school horror games. I don't know if that one's gonna make it in the rotation, but uh, I do have some, some days where I just have like mystery game. Go, Laura, go. I also own a copy of three. Um, and I don't know anything about two. What the hell? Why's my face like that? <laughs> Whatever. Oh, he's back. Don't even play two. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I I trust you, man. You know what's going on. Can I hide in this? Laura, what what are you doing, Laura? Okay, boomer. <laughs> me. <laughs> I'm gonna assume that's at me. Not it should be. <laughs> Wait, this is a dead end. Oh no. This is still locked, right? Yeah. Locked. Wait, how do I access my inventory? What? Oh, I have perfume. What other games are I playing this month? Uh, so tomorrow, well actually today, I'm going to be playing a second game as well, hopefully. Although I'm going to stream a bit later. Um, I'll be playing D. Uh, that puzzle. Uh, I don't even know how to classify that. <laughs> um, yeah, the horror game D. And uh, then after that, I will be playing... Oh shit, he's over here. There he is. Ah. Sorry, tomorrow night I'll be playing uh, Phantasmagoria. And, um. Gosh, what else am I playing? Completely blanking. <laughs> yeah, that's why I hear uh, D is very short. That's why I was trying to fit in this and D. Unfortunately, I got started late today because uh, I had some plumbing issues with my house, but uh, those are resolved, thankfully. <laughs> Yeah, what else is on the docket? Hold on, let me... I got a calendar here. Just whip that up while I'm... Oh, he's here. Oh, go, Laura. Fell right into my trap, Mr. Scissorman. Oh my god, Laura, go. <laughs> oh yeah, next week I'm playing Harvester. Uh, then I'm gonna go play uh, Castlevania 1 and 3. That'll be another double double game stream or two streams uh, and then alone in the dark one two and three and lastly oh, I have d2 on the calendar but I don't think I'm actually gonna play that I tried it out a little bit and it was messed up oh hell yeah dude siren I've never heard of that I'll have to check it out why are you still over here no <laughs> am I dead mash it mash it Take his scissors away. Uh-oh. <laughs> I think I'm dead. Dead end. Whoops. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, I mainly, uh, just in general on my channel, I mainly stream, like, horror games. Uh, sometimes they're old, sometimes they're not. Oh, yeah. There's no save points. <laughs> I think I knew that. Well, we didn't really make that much progress anyway. Just go for the quick start here. Oh, nice. It even gets to this part, too. Yeah, I have a huge backlog of, like, horror games I haven't played, so. But, lately I've been messing with, um, some of the DLCs in Resident Evil 7, and, uh, uh, Song of Horror, which is an amazing indie horror game, if you like it. It's like, a kind of like an old-school, tank-controlled, puzzle-based, uh, atmospheric kind of horror game. It's got a ton of nods to Silent Hill and, and Resident Evil in it. Oh yeah, Haunting Ground, uh, actually I don't, I thought I was going to put that on my list originally, I guess I just didn't, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I've heard a lot of people talk about that one, I'm excited to play that, whenever I do actually do it. Empty. 
Is there RNG in this? Hold on. Or do I just have the key somehow? Let's, uh, inventory. Whoa. <laughs> no, don't leave. Oh my god. You know, so far I'm having fun with this. I, uh... I should definitely look the controls up, because I don't know what I'm doing right now. Oh, maybe I just have L and R set to something weird. No. No, that is what it is. Alright, I don't... Oh, maybe I don't have any items. Okay, yeah. The key might have moved. That's cool. I am not I was not expecting that from, like, a game this old. Throw in some replayability there with just random stuff. Oh, right. Yeah, I can't open that. I, I thought I was trying to <laughs> inspect the dresser, but that's not a thing. <coughs> nice. Yeah. Seems to be the consensus from the horror community. Or the horror game. You... <laughs> okay, the perfume's still here. That's good. Smells like Miss Mary's. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, I just didn't have any, um... Dropping the stream to 480p. Makes sense. <laughs> Why is my face just a negative out there? Weird. Can I use this on the bird? I don't really know what I'm thinking. Okay. Let's leave. Sorry to have disturbed you, Mr. Bird. It was funny because you literally beat it in four minutes. Nice. Yeah, I know there's like a bunch of different endings in it. Oh. Good job, Laura. <laughs> oh. That bird made good on its threat. I have a feeling I'm probably gonna find all the ways to die in this game. <laughs> Not... Oh, I think I hit full start. Yep, hold on. Set game. Oh no! <laughs> now you know it's an emulation. Because, <laughs> you know, nobody knew that previously. Um, one thing I should look up, so I'm trying to do this blind, but I do think it would be <laughs> probably prudent to figure out what the controls are. Because, uh, right now I have no freaking clue. I know, right? <laughs> Supposed to just memes of... Yeah, this is totally 100%. Uh, <laughs> JIT copy, etc. No. Um, oh yeah, clock tower controls. <laughs> oh yeah, SNES clock tower controls. Walk through, tell me how to play. Uh, controls. A okay, D-pad, obviously. Uh, Y button makes, oh wait, Jennifer? Why did I think her name was Mary? Oh, she was calling the one per, er, I think I've just been calling her random names. <laughs> okay, whatever. Make Jennifer walk to an area on screen or click and point. Double click for run. Cool. X button makes Jennifer stop walking or running. A brings up your inventory. B tap rapidly when in panic or danger mode to evade death. That would have been really good. L and R makes her run left and right respectively. Cool. Okay, that helps a lot. <laughs> Oh my god, I can use continue to not have to restart every single time. Checked up on some horror games, and my mouth dropped to some of the prices. It's insane. Haunting Ground is incredibly rare, I know. I like Based on reputation alone, I kind of wanted to get a copy of it, but I looked at the price, and I'm like, oh my god, it's no way. Um, it's not really horror, but I've been trying to get a copy of God Hand for like the longest time. So I'd love to play that like on a PS2, but like the US version is ridiculously priced. 
And it doesn't help that, like, uh, the Japanese version and the PAL version are both, like, cheaper. So whenever I try to get results, it tries to show me those first. And it's like, no, I don't have a PS2 that can play that. Yeah. <laughs> well, actually, I don't even know. Can PAL versions play, uh... Or... I need, like, a special PS2 for that, right? Oh, nice! Okay, I had no idea. I'm gonna have to do that, because I know you can get, like, an adapter to play uh, Japanese discs on your PS2, but that's, like, a whole thing. <laughs> well, now that I know there's a continue button, this will probably go a little more smoothly. But yeah, thanks. That's I didn't even know. Oh, nice. Yeah, no, for sure. Especially with a lot of those games that like just weren't popular over here or for whatever reason just didn't get as uh widely produced. I do have uh one of those uh, cartridges for my SNES that lets you put like an SD card in the top of it and you can play any ROMs on it. That's a pretty cool thing. Especially for like ROM hacks. Like I love playing uh, Super Mario World ROM hacks. Or at least, I haven't done it in a really long time, but I do enjoy them. I just need like the hook trick or something to swap the disc out. Yeah, uh, yeah. But like you're saying, I mean, in the long run, it's probably the way to go. think now that I have learned the controls <laughs> that I would be uh, moving more efficiently. Oh, that's some nice stained glass. I hope it doesn't break. What? Sorry, I've seen this cutscene already. <laughs> oh god. Who is that? And... Well, she dead. Bye. Okay, yeah, don't open that door or anything. Sweet Home for the NES is wild as well if you like RPGs. Oh, I actually just played that. Um, I finished it on Tuesday. But yeah, if you want to check the VODs, I finished that. It's, uh, that was a good one. Haha, <laughs> try now, Scissorman. Ain't getting in here. Oh, he's getting in here. Oh, boy. <laughs> um... <laughs> Well then, but yeah, I actually don't like RPGs, but I, I loved that game. That was sweet. Oh, off with my head. I also watched the movie, <laughs> which it's a good movie. And actually, the adaptation, like, as far as an NES like movie video game adaptation for something so weird. Uh, they did a pretty good job. <laughs> Has the entire story, and, uh, yeah. Oh, he's coming. Wait, wait. Why am I going in here? I know what's in here already. Oh, now he's on the left side. Played myself. Um, I need to find a way to loop around him. But it seems like he's spawning in random spots. So part of me thinks like maybe if I just spam going in and out of the store. <laughs> Most part, I'm not a fan of movie video game transitions. Uh, we'll say there are a few. Go yeah, no, I mean they, they usually screw it up. I completely agree. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to run so far. Okay. I'm tapping. Yeah. Oh, he's still slapping me in the face. He's <laughs> fucking jumping for joy. This is the bathroom door, isn't it? Yeah, I didn't want to go in here. <laughs> I remember as a kid, I really liked the um, the Silent Hill movie adaptation. Or I guess a teenager and a kid. But looking back on it, if I ever go back to watch it, I probably wouldn't like it. <laughs> 
Looks like Angus Young with scissors. He does. <laughs> I'm struggling to find lyrics in my head for even a single ACDC song. Wait, that's the right band, right? <laughs> This film like 15 minutes from my house. <laughs> that's that's wild. Oh nice! I used my key. More like Jay Leno schoolboy with a serious case of moldy prune face. <laughs> that's true. Ontario, nice. Oh shit! Don't die. <laughs> that's what I get for reading chat. Can't disagree with that either. <laughs> Chat's more fun, exactly. I mean, it's, it's a video game, whatever. Just here to lure people in so I can chat with them. <laughs> anyway, hope you're all having a good day. <laughs> okay, let's try that again and not die this time. Is that how that? What? <laughs> Oh yeah, I was calling her Laura earlier, probably because I was talking about D. That was Jennifer's fault. I had to put down the fork. <laughs> Hell am I? You could put an IDE hard drive in a PS2 with a network adapter thing. Yeah. Man, I was like ticked. Even though it's actually like really good that they added this. Uh, but I think it was Resident Evil Outbreak 2. Uh, when they first launched that game, it didn't have support for the, um, the HDD drives or whatever, or, like, the, the fast loaders, um, and my friend and I were, like, kind of, oh god, <laughs> kind of low-key, like, speedrunning that, wait, did I just go in here? Oh, yeah! <laughs> Suck it. Anyway. Uh, we were speedrunning, like, individual levels, and we actually, like, had the record for, like, a day, and then the next day they added, um, HDD support, and, <laughs> like, our time just got blown out of the water, and I couldn't afford an adapter because I was a teenager. The <laughs> looks pretty deep. There's something shiny in there. But, I mean, I'm sure that time's been blown out of the water many times since. I want to play that so bad. Oh, yeah, um, so there's Japanese server. Actually, hold on, let me get you a link. Fuck, I think I said this to somebody else earlier that was in my chat on a different stream and I never actually followed up with that. Break. So you can still play it online with an emulator. Actually, technically you can play it online with a PS2, but it requires an insane amount of steps. Um, no, this isn't the link. Where is this? Character stats. Well, this is the forum that it's on. <laughs> Playing online, yes. Oh wait, no, no, this is the subject, okay. Ultimate status tracker, no, we don't need that. Uh, what do I need to play via emulator, I think? Yes. Check that out. Um, so, there's a weird thing where you actually need to create a login. Yeah, I'm, I fucking, I love Outbreak, I love, <laughs> giving people uh, uh, sources so they can continue to play Outbreak in the way that it's meant to be played. Hell yeah. Very much welcome. <laughs> what? Lots of technical books, question mark, question mark, question mark. <laughs> yeah. I would honestly say it's probably my favorite Resident Evil game. It's, it's between that and, like, Code Veronica. But I like pretty much all the games in that series. Yeah, that was the game I was harassing you guys about to like, hey guys, set this game up. <laughs> it's so cool. For anyone unaware, it's like um it's basically just like old school uh Resident Evil, but online with four people in a co op scenario. Discord. What? Is my Discord command broken? I don't have a Discord. I have your Discord, Knight. <laughs> That's a good point. Yeah, hell yeah. Actually, let me get that Discord link. 
<laughs> I mean, Night Revenge, you could get the Discord link too, but <laughs> I got it. Also, I've also just realized something. Knight, why have I not modded you? Um, I think you actually can't post links um, unless you're mod. What the hell? God, did they move it or am I just blind? Their server? Invite people, there we go. No, I just can't read, that's all. No, no, no. Oh, cool, it has streamer mode on, so it's hiding this. Oh, good, perfect, there we go. I think I re-enabled that, because I didn't have a need to not have it enabled. Anyway, thank you. We'll get back to our regularly scheduled game. <laughs> I gotta wire that up. I, I swear I had that wired up at one point, where exclamation point discord linked to you. But yeah, I, that's basically my, di well, I don't want to say my Discord. It's Night Revenge's Discord, but that's the Discord I use for Twitch stuff, so I'm very much there. And scroll up in general and see all the stupid memes I post. <laughs> Wait, this is how I got in here. I'm all turned around now. Okay, so we've killed Dan Sisserman. He's definitely not coming back ever. So game one. Now we just live in this house. Probably won't look at this. No, it's totally cool. Yeah. Um. Oh, there's a looking for group channel. Um. I don't know if that's visible to everybody. It should be though. Um. <laughs> that's probably the best place to like coordinate. But yeah, I'm super down to play that. It. By the way, it is a pain in the ass to get set up. But once you set it up, it's like it's it's done. You don't need to like. Do you do any steps? You destroyed that? Oh, right, you just redid all the. What the hell did I do? Ah! Just general everything? Okay, cool. Dan? That's Bobby. Bobby Scissorman? Why did I think his name was Dan Scissorman? Unless you mean some other Dan. <laughs> I was just in general, so I have an excuse to piss off the other admin and make more channel. Oh, nice, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, I was... I don't know how I forgot about that. I was completely part of those discussions of, like, yeah, let's keep this more focused and not have 10 million channels. <laughs> Damn, Eugene. Not Eugene, but... Damn you, comma, Gene. I know he's not watching, but... Oh, crap. Okay, so there are two scissormen. Well, I killed his brother. He's the wildest of the bunch. Oh, Gene is. <laughs> so just started uh, streaming. Didn't have the time to make Discord. Yeah, I mean, the main thing is, like... Just managing it, <laughs> like setting it up is really quick, but sometimes it feels like somebody's watching. All right, I'm going to stop now. <laughs> Nobody needs to hear that. Yeah, we kind of just have like a small coalition of uh, streamers and Night Revenge's Discord, so why we uh, do it that way. By the way, Night Revenge, a wonderful streamer. He also streams horror games fairly frequently. Not exclusively, though. Ours. <laughs> Need a communism symbol to throw in there. That's true. You know, at the end of the day, we do kind of collectively run that thing. I'm super glad to find out that I, there's not permadeath in this game. Oh god. Am I dead? I can't move. I'm definitely dead. When I saw Clock Tower, I thought it was Resident Evil 3. <laughs> nice. Oh, wait. I think I could have avoided dying there. Like if I tap the uh, survive button. They I control you guys. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Did 
Damn, that's a uh, res three. A bit different. Thanks. I hope you're well as well. I gotta play that again. I also, I don't know. I kind of want to play Inferno mode of uh, RE3 remake, but I also don't care that much. I did think about RE3. So uh, original RE3, uh, love it. It's a good game. RE3 remake. It's also a good game, but it's very disappointed. <laughs> very disappointing. Like they had a lot of potential. Oh, I can just leave. Nice. Oh shit. Gotta press the action button. <laughs> no, I just gotta dodge that. Get wrecked, doll. Um. Yeah, no, I definitely will play three again. Like I, so it was super weird, and I think I said the exact same thing. Uh, it was last Friday. <laughs> Moby can probably attest to this. Um, like I, I only played three like one time as a kid, and like I, it was fine, whatever. But I never like thought like, oh, I love that game or anything. But uh, last October, I played through all of the main series, um, and uh, when I was playing three, I'm like, oh my god, this is freaking great. I love it. And then the, the announcement came out for like, oh, we're remaking three now that there's two remake out there. I'm like, oh my god, two remake is an awesome game. Three is an awesome like thing that they could definitely modernize very well, and it kind of sucked. <laughs> I mean, it didn't suck, but it's whatever. I'll play three when it isn't $30. Yeah, no, absolutely. Oh yeah, <laughs> Night Revenge and I played five and six together with co-op. That was super fun. I was I was a whiny little something or other playing RE6, but honestly, it's not that bad. Um, I I I'm probably in the minority of this, but I actually hated the Leon campaign probably the most. Um, Chris's is really stupid, and I know why most people hate that one the most, but I actually like had fun with the campiness of it too short yeah it's way too short like what's there is great uh the ho yeah the hospital is amazing until you get to the end which is baffling on so many levels like there's the things can't technically work as well so you have those like weird fade out effects for the zombies instead of how they normally manage them they like just explode like a gusher um and uh, like just a defense segment in general is just jank but one that changes the rules of the game is i don't know it's a little weak um. Yeah, no. the The main thing with RE three, if anyone thinks of like the original, like, oh yeah, uh, you're in a semi open environment, evading like Nemesis, and that's just that's in like the first maybe two hours of the game. <laughs> just a simple plank of wood. Okay, cool. How do I use it though? Oh, I didn't make the hole back downstairs. So she probably doesn't know that she needs that. RE6 was great for jokes in most of the Melee movie part. Yeah, I <laughs> another one that everyone hates is Jake's campaign, but I actually had a lot of fun playing Jake. Get the freaking combos. It's almost like the uh, RE7 DLC. And that's all I'm going to say because I don't want to spoil anything about that. I know Night Revenge just got that that game. It's not about the journey. Oh wait, no, it's not about the destination. It's about the memes you make along the way. Before they were fun, it's just not... Oh, totally. And, like, it's so weird, because, like, 3 is really where, like, the action, you know, the turn towards action started. It's just, it's still on that older engine, so you still have the tank controls and all that stuff. It's a corpse of a crow. There's a key here. Cage key. Nice. I, I, uh, yeah, like I said, I, uh, I don't really have anything too much against any mainline RE game. Uh, I've never touched Umbrella Chronicles. I know everybody hates that one a lot. Um, <laughs> or Dark Side Chronicles as well. I've never touched it. Uh, Dead Aim, I absolutely hate, <laughs> but I don't think many people would defend that game. <laughs> Survivor, I'm not the biggest fan of. It's a good meme to watch people play, though. Um, did I three because yeah, that is the most like hilarious thing with that game. Hundred percent. Uh, slow. Oh, actually, how, how do I pronounce that? It's Slo Slosher Raptor. Okay, now I get it. <laughs> I can read sometimes. <laughs> but yeah, 
like CVX is actually supposed to be the third Resident Evil game, but they're just like, uh, let's call me Sacha. So that works too. <laughs> but yeah, Code Veronica is supposed to be the actual um, Resident Evil 3, but Sony was like, no, you can't have your mainline game not on our uh, console, so flip them. <laughs> but I mean, RE3 is good too, so. <laughs> it's cat. That's a big cat. I need to play Code Veronica again. Done that in quite some time. I didn't play it last October because it wasn't part of the mainline series. But yeah. Uh, Remoothered? I have never heard of that whatsoever. Nice. Love the recommendations. Thanks, man. Like, it's, uh... It's great. Oh, Remothered. Yeah, no, I haven't heard of that. <laughs> huh. I need to turn the... Like, I have a physical like, piece of uh, post-it note that I write all these games down on. I have no idea why I haven't digitized that, <laughs> but I need to do that. This list is getting pretty long. But I love it. <laughs> oh, I can look in these areas. Are these doors? They are. Check that one out for sure. Nice. Sounds great. Yeah, forget... Um... Oh, jeez, what was the game? Oh, I already brought that up. Never mind. Yeah, uh, Song of Horror. Like, someone recommended that to me, and I'm like, wait, this is what? Oh, and it just, like, finished its, like, last chapter? <laughs> and it's really freaking fun. I haven't finished that yet, though. I definitely recommend that to anyone who's, like, a fan of survival horror. Ooh, piano room. I'm just kind of on autopilot here. I have no idea. Welcome to Goon Discovers Hallways. What the hell is that? Oh! Oh! No, don't turn the lights on. Run! Saw you, Dan Scissorman. He's coming. Thank you for the follow, Slash Raptor. I don't think I touched that, but okay. <laughs> no! I think I'm dead. Nope, I'm not dead. Go! Oh my god, Jennifer. Heck yeah. Oh good, sacrifice room. Why'd I walk in here? <laughs> uh, well. <laughs> Here we go. Dead again. <laughs> I, right, yeah. Now, I didn't center myself on the pentagram. I, I could have done that, but, uh... <laughs> oh, well. I think the implication there is that she's supposed to be getting, like, beheaded. But I guess they weren't cool with that, so uh, it just is what it is. Yeah, at least I'm in the vicinity, you know? <laughs> there's probably, there's got to be something to do in that room. Oh my god. <laughs> it's like tripping in Smash Bros. Can I? Come on. Door. Alright, she's not going to use that door. She's going to use this door instead. Go. Oh, in here. I'll never catch us in here. Oh my god. <laughs> Unless you keep tripping, then maybe he will. What the hell is this door? door seems to be stuck. Okay. Well, I guess we'll keep moving then.
Is this the same hallway that I was in before? Oh yeah, it is. Okay, so there's no need to go up those stairs. Uh, well, no, I haven't looked at everything up those stairs. Two doors? No, I want to go in that door. Huh. Now, if I know this, uh, when your picture starts changing colors, distress meter. Oh, that's why that's happening. Thank you. I <laughs> literally would have never figured that out. How are you in? You didn't even open the door. <laughs> Damn it. Scissored again. Wait. <laughs> Said nothing. <laughs> oh boy. Can I not interact with anything in here? Uh-oh. Oh, yeah, I'm probably too, like, stressed to do any of that. Some of it red. Let's see if I can bait him. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Who could have seen that coming? Alright, maybe let's try to get some distance between us and, and the scissor man. <laughs> First, we gotta leave this kitchen. It's a shame there's nothing I can use to kill him. Like that bookshelf. Like the fridge. It, yeah, it wouldn't let me even do that. <laughs> I was trying. Oh, he's here. You gonna climb up here with them scissors? What's she doing? <laughs> this is just like Granny. Haha. <laughs> Don't go down! Okay. <laughs> That's right, I have a stop button. It's always important to remember. I got that hair in my mouth. Okay, I guess we can go now. I'm dead. <laughs> oh yeah? Then why am I still living? Sure, I can't just leave from here, but uh, let's let's see. This is a key, a car key. Pocketed the car key. Can I leave? Oh snap! Keys aren't here. I have the keys. What? Oh, this key you have to use. <laughs> okay, whatever. I can get out of here with this car. Oh, snap. Oh, if I stayed in the corner, I would have been killed. <laughs> nice. Oh, that's amazing. I can leave. <laughs> well, I want to uh that <laughs> let's let's explore the house. We can get car ending, I guess, but I know there's way more interesting stuff in the game. That's probably what you meant when you said, like, you can beat the game in, like, six minutes. You just run straight to this room and <laughs> drive away. At a minimum, we have the option now. I should go into the kitchen, but I'm still at red stress, and... Oh, wait, wait, wait.
I don't think this is gonna work. It's not a cage, it's just a door. It seems that the door is locked. Cool. So I can get across that one gap in the uh, other large hallway if I wanted to. Got to rest if you don't want to be right. Oh, damn. <laughs> well, I guess I should do that. Gas tanks for a stove. Okay. I don't know why they put so many things close together. It's very hard to, like, <laughs> select separate things. Drinks are lined up here, okay. Ham was put in here. I don't know why I even, like, tag things as, like, blind playthroughs, because honestly, uh... I know that there's bugs in there, and I know that I should have bug spray to get through them. <laughs> so I'm not gonna open the... I don't even know what that is. Is that like a... Um... It's like an industrial sized freezer you'd have in like a... Kitchen or something. Wait, did I go in this door? Yeah, I did. I came out of it. Well, if you're saying that rest will make us not red, let's go take a rest. This game is honestly the first roguelike experimental. Yeah, like, I, I'm i digging this a lot. Like, just the randomness elements themselves, um, that's really freaking cool for a game like this old. Um, oh, wait, this is the bathroom. <laughs> Turn the light on. Leave. Should know by now that I can just press R to do that. What is she doing? Jennifer. To the right. <laughs> Actually, even the idea of like not being able to fully control your character, it's pretty cool. Based on stress and such. There's actually a lot of story to it, depending on how far you get. Like you said, multi-endings. Yeah, I'm going to try to explore at least a good bit of this game. Like, it could be kind of silly to just... uh. The left bed isn't used. Okay, so left bed. <laughs> okay. Could totally just plow through this, then go into D, which is also not very long, but I don't think that's <laughs> it's a good stream, so. Okay, so I'm guessing I don't use the beds to rest. I guess that kind of makes sense. Uh, That couch from earlier might be good. It's definitely cool to see, like, how people achieve, like, horror in, obviously, something a little less, like, graphically intensive. Just, like, the right... setting the right music. Art direction is definitely important as well. This game looks actually amazing. Wait, what is this thing? Oh, it's just the table in the foreground. All right, I have no idea where I go to rest, but that's fine. <laughs> I'll just go up here. Wait, before I do that, never mind, too late. I'm already committed to going up the stairs. Also, excuse me. <laughs> I'm goon for this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I was just looking at Discord in the uh, three hours it took me to walk up these stairs. Okay, so if I run this way, the ground should break, and then I should know that I can get that hole, or whatever.
Okay. And down the stairs we go. Ah. <laughs> I should totally include my, uh, thing I'm doing this month in my channel description. I don't know why I didn't do that. Especially their, uh, schedule. There we go. We're down here. That's where my mind drifts off to. <laughs> Dang. What the hell? Oh, ham. That's right, I picked up ham. I completely forgot about that. <laughs> ham and perfume. I wonder if I can spray him with perfume. Or wait, can I spray myself with perfume? Nope. <laughs> wait, so if I was able to get in that other, like, dark area, what? Okay, I guess I can't go in this one. Go figure. So, where am I headed? Oh, okay, I want to go get the, uh, plank of wood. There's definitely a bunch of rooms I ran through in the upper, uh, hallway that I was already in. Um, just because I was getting chased. I should go look at those. But, for now I can get the wood and go back to that other place, because I know I need to go there. Oh, staircase. Here we go again. I'm actually not sure exactly where that was. I think it was to the right? Nope, there's nothing to the right, so... Probably back over this way. Lighting the camera to try to hit things, uh... appropriately. Yes, it was through here. Okay. Oh, right! There's a gap there now. Oh, dang it. I had to go from the bottom floor and then up that other staircase. That makes sense. You know, instead of doing that, I'm gonna check this room out because I haven't been over here. Oh, there's two doors. Locked. What about this one? Nice. Yeah, thanks. You take care. Nice to meet you as well. That sure is a box right there. Oh wait, can I push the box? What about this stick over here? It's like a bird's nest. Ah, now I can get stick. Oh, don't do that. <laughs> oh, Jennifer. Ham? Want some ham bird? <laughs> Didn't work. Wait, this snapped onto him. I'm gonna spray a bird with perfume? It's kind of terrible, but... thing is inside. What are you doing? <laughs> Looks like a bird's nest. I'm gonna just try this. <laughs> I feel like I should be able to push this, but... Eh. I don't know how. <laughs> so I suppose we'll move on. Aha! <laughs> I 
Some broken tableware. No. What? <laughs> some rope. Up some rope. Nothing else is here. I want to go over there, though. Sadly, he doesn't want to go over there. Okay. Again, having seen, like, a little bit of this game, I'm, like, 100% sure you can push this crate. Ow. Pause the game by accident. <laughs> That's a hiding spot. Oh, okay. Gotcha. So there's not. I don't actually need to go over there. Oh, whatever. Ah. <sighs> okay. Back down to the other floor. Then I suppose I'll go get that rope, or the, not the rope, the plank. I don't know what the, uh, rope's used for, but I'm sure we'll find the use. Likewise, I have that cage key, and I don't really know what to do with it. And I believe I got, like, the graveyard key? That's probably outside. So why would it be inside? <laughs> Did I look at this door last time? Oh no, this is the door that's stuck. Yeah. Okay, there's the stairs. Wait, was there anything over this way? Oh, I think this is a dead end room. I probably investigated already? No, I haven't been here. Okay. Bunch of mannequins. It's very creepy. Mannequin is wearing a dress. Her head fell off. This mannequin is wearing a dress. All of them are. Looks nice. <laughs> Falls over. Times. It's just a, a room where you can die somehow. Don't look like there's anything else to investigate there. Oh right, we came through at that door. <clears throat> I think there's a pretty good chance that that plank is just going to get me another shortcut. Because I, I bet that that side hallway loops around to the other area where the second gap is. And I can't get in there. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's great. I love the randomness. Oh, no. Strange symbols are written here. Time will cause adherence. What does that mean? Strange sim- no. Oh, oh, she's reading that. There's an iron disc. A cross has been carved into it. Okay. Pro corpse. Neck is completely severed. Sweet. It's 
a Celadon vase. Oh, there's a thing up here. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, I figured that there's something going on in this room, but I probably don't have what I need yet. It's most likely a clue towards it, I bet. Oh, the cat tells you where Bobby hides sometimes? That's funny. <laughs> or it's like, uh, swaps out. Love that symbol. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I don't think I actually looked in here before Bobby popped out. There's only junk inside. Okay. Oh, I can examine the cabinets too. Not sure if I did any of that. The record player. It's unplugged. All kinds of music here. Oh, okay. It's like part of the ceiling fell, yeah. Courtesy of our friend, Bobby Scissorman. Ah, go in here. Oh, right, I wasn't here already. I think nothing was over here. Um. Oh, there was a room. Yeah. Okay. This is all where I got the cemetery key. Well, at least they quiet down when you turn the light off. I guess. So if I do want to actually grab that blank, it's right here, so I should do that. Take a short trip up the stairs. Ugh. Excuse me. <laughs> really? Well, at least I can do a dance about it. Common sense, man. Common sense. Stop acting like a plank. <laughs> like a simple plank of wood. Yeah, sitting there that could be used and placed. I know, right? Jennifer, pick up the freaking plank. So, this bathroom is just here. Potential hiding spot for, for Bobby. Not there. I don't know why he decides to go in this room every single time after I, like, uh, turn that sink on. <laughs> Looks like the shower is working. Oh, wait, can I turn it on and, like, steam up the room? Find a clue? Some other kind of Scooby-Doo bullshit? <laughs> Guessing I just need a key to whatever that door is um, on the first floor. I 
and that'll probably open up a lot of stuff. Wonder. Yeah, no. <laughs> Ham plus wood? No. Good. Maybe if I put some perfume on the. Wait, wait. First floor can be. Okay. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna try to use the rope on everything now. <laughs> I kind of assume that you can get down to something with it. But I don't know that. Oh, I don't think I went in here actually. Nope, I did. Just another room full of rubble. Maybe I do have to open the uh the thing with bugs in it. No, I don't have any insecticide. I think this is the room with the uh like yeah, the fireplace room. Wait a second. I wonder who lit this. Trying to get some roasted ham. Time to have this perfume blow up in our faces. Damn. I'm going to take a, a second look in here because I don't, I don't know that I did check everything. Desk is dusty. Portrait of a middle aged woman. Dot. Books. Just some books. Wait, is there something in the trash, maybe? D. Damn. One of these rooms somewhere has to have something in it. Things written in this look serious. Okay. Big clown doll. <sighs> I'm missing here. Oh, I think I already examined that though. Whatever that is. Looks like a child's bed. It's dirty with stains and dust. No white lag there for a second. I think Bobby's loaded in somewhere. It's waiting to strike. Oh, wait a minute. That's right, there's something in that hole over there. I, I forgot all about that. I don't know if I have the thing I need to get it, though. Eternity magazine? This crevice looks pretty deep. There's something shiny in there. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. Help. I'm also losing my mind. I have all these items and I have not used like any of them. <laughs> Wait a minute, there was one other thing in there. I guess I've used the car key, which is technically the only thing you need <laughs> to win.
Wait, so this is the other side of that. What in the hell am I missing here? Dinosaur sounds, what? <laughs> Almost like a Metroid sound. Oh my god! <laughs> Just close that. Walk away like nothing happened. Oh, I guess she's just leaving. That's fine. <laughs> There's anything else to look at in there anyway. Is that crow puzzle? There's oh. What else is there? Oh. <laughs> it's the gap I can't get over. Which actually I think that is another part of the house now that I've looked up this area thoroughly. Oh, I wanted that door back there. Well, I guess we'll... Yeah, why is that one just not interactable at all? Very strange. Alt room, which has something for later. Um, what was this room again? This might be the doll room. No, the doll room's on the second floor. Piano room. Well, let's try this again. No, she's not gonna... Oh, yeah, okay, maybe this will work. Work in summoning Dan Scissorman, that is. Or Bobby Scissorman. Scissorman. Oh, well, certainly didn't hurt. <laughs> Weird that we haven't run into like anything in a while now. Ah, there we go. <laughs> Camera, please. Is that door that's stuck? And there's just a couple of locked doors, but obviously those just need keys. Um. Oh, 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 oh. I just thought of something. Also, I hear that phone like ringing, but I don't know where a phone is, so. Oh well. Yeah, so I, I tried to go down that one hallway in the beginning, and I might have just been clicking incorrectly. There might actually be something down that way. So up the stairs on the right, or the east wing. I can go in here now? What? Oh shit, okay. Crawl out of this house. Deep crack in the wall. Crumbling. Okay. Spray some perfume on that. Good to go. I'll just leave the ham here. Damn ham. Oh, 
thought I was on so something there. Well, goon. Lurk. Fair enough. See you, knight. Ah, nice. Enjoy the rest of your day. <laughs> Luckily, I took today off. Granted, I spent half of it doing housework, but whatever. <laughs> Sorry for the big yawn there. I, uh... I think... Hopefully there's going to be something to the right up here that I haven't tried yet. Because, no, <coughs> excuse me, throat's so dry today, what's up with that? That's where I'd put my hydration request if I hadn't, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Set up channel points. Well, darn. Now I have no idea where to go. Oh, I know what I should do. I should check the uh, garage area once again. Wait, maybe I have to see what's her name's corpse. I can inspect the toilet too. Cancel. Cancel action. Damn it. The shower is working. Oh, she's not here this time. I don't have to go right now. On running. Oh yeah, I'm gonna just open that bug cabinet kitchen. Maybe there won't be bugs in it. Who knows? Probably will be though. Hope this doesn't kill me. Well, I guess I don't really care because I can just restart if it does. Something shiny here. Oh, yep. Eek. And I'm dropping frames. Why am I dropping frames? It's over. Good. Okay, now we just got trail of this on ourselves now. And they're gone. <laughs> Crisis averted. Let's do it again. Wait, wait, wait. What's this? An 
an iron frying pan. Gas tanks for a stove. I guess I'm going to say. Ugh. I where that came from. <laughs> Nothing. Oh wait, was there anything else in the fridge? Oh, can I inspect the freezer? No. It's empty. Yeah. Let's go again. Yay. Watch, <laughs> are gonna kill me this time or something. <laughs> she just closes it. <laughs> oh, I think I'm gonna die this time. She's on autopilot. Oh no. Definitely not helping my stress gauge. But, uh. Whatever. She looks fine. Oh, can I take that shovel? No, okay. <laughs> Felt a little silly. Good. Oh, she can just sit down and rest. Cool. Oh, yeah, we're in orange caution now. Oh, maybe she needs to be less stressed to get certain items or do things like push the box. Let's get back to full health here. Make ourselves a nice relaxing rest. <sighs> Once again. This has been Sleepy Playthroughs by Goon. Not get any more health back than that. Oh, there we go. Oh, hell yeah. Healing up. It's nothing. That's probably full health, but I'm going to wait a good minute <laughs> just in case. And more health. Oh uh, yeah, okay, that's gotta be full. Excellent. Okay, nothing else is here. Dang, I was gonna try to inspect the trunk. But you know what? I'm gonna go try to do some of the things on the second floor now. That looked kind of like... Puzzles I should be able to solve. Oh man. <laughs> oh whatever, I'll go rest again. I guess you can rest wherever, which is handy. Uh, yeah. And hey, maybe that's why you don't run everywhere? <laughs> but also... Whoa, 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 wait, no, 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 stop. Stop. Ah, she won't stop. The doors I'm thinking of are on the other side. This way. Maybe I have to answer that phone. Wherever it is. Seems plausible. I believe to the right it's just a dead end, but I'm going to double check. No, wait, it is a dead end. I remember something, finally.
press back up to blue, and we'll see. Oh, maybe she can't rest in this room. That's unfortunate. I inspect the can of insect set. Oh my god! Oh, <laughs> wow. Okay, well, solved one puzzle. I'm curious though, if I'm able to push this or not now that I'm not in red or orange caution. Or press whatever. <laughs> Thing is inside. I feel like poking that bird's nest with the stick is not the way to get that. You gotta push that box up over there. I may cheat and look up a guide. Figure out how to push the thing. It's clearly if there's something I'm missing. Can I rest here? Maybe it has to be a room with a light on. That might be the differentiator, or the... Or did I press a button to make it? No. <laughs> no. I did not. Okay, yeah. It just has to be a, a lit room. Takes, takes quite a while to happen. <laughs> But full strength or not, or uh, I guess since I'm still up here, I might as well try it. I'm gonna wait like a couple seconds so I don't just immediately drop back down to yellow. Although I don't really know how it works, so <laughs> it could be that as soon as you hit blue, you're at max and there's nothing else you can do. But uh, my guess is that's not the case. So I don't know. Try to be a little more cautious about using that up. <laughs> more walking but this time we're walking with purpose because we know where we're going okay looks like a no-go There's no other reason that box would be there, though. You weren't supposed to just push it over and have it be in a spot. <laughs> but I don't know, maybe. Oh, the phone's probably in that locked room. Well, hopefully we'll get a key to something. I assume that's what the something shiny is. Um, there's that crack in the wall in the book room as well. Uh, I don't think I know what I need to actually get that, but I'm sure I'll find other items as I go further here. Now we'll just casually walk down these steps. There we go. <laughs> Took me a minute, but I finally got it. Why is it my... It's bizarre. That's not the kitchen. <laughs> Kitchen's the other way. No, don't hit the light switch. 
Oh my god. Uh Okay, there we go. Yeah, I think that's just like a weird quirk of the um the movement system. It's like I'm at pretty low stress level right now. So, I wouldn't ex be expecting her to, uh, straight up not do the thing I'm trying to do. I'm wondering if I did pass, like, a telephone at some point and I could go answer that phone, but I don't think I did. What a wonderful icon for insecticide. It's a barrel. Old, like, steel Donkey Kong barrel. Boom! Take this, you cockroaches. He's left behind. Pocketed the gold key. Okay, well that opens one of these doors. Got to. Is it this door? Sure is. Maybe that opens multiple doors. Oh, hey. Ms. Mary. Glad to see you're safe, Jennifer. Why's she holding something behind her back? Mary. Everyone. Everyone. Everything is going to be just fine. Yeah, you're being weird. Run. Is it poison? <laughs> no, I'm not drinking that. Get out of here. Well, drink this. <laughs> it'll be. It'll calm you down. No, why would you drink that? Huh? <laughs> Good job, Jennifer. Just dead. No option. Oh God. <laughs> I think I got the cage key. Uh, where? Eh. Yeah. Who are you? Uh, uh, food. He's food. Let's eat him. Oh no! He's gonna eat me! Yeah, my food! <laughs> okay, so don't talk to that guy. Noted. Oh yeah, I do have ham. <laughs> what do you know? I was thinking I'd just use the cell key to get out. His uh, right art looks like Dr. Disrespect for some reason. <laughs> um, who are you? Not that portrait thing down there, but doesn't matter. <laughs> this man is Barrows? Oh damn, he's turned into a cannibal. <laughs> huh? Right now, it's watching you. Huh? Watching you cradle under the star. Okay, 
But also, I'm getting out of here. See ya. Oh, hey. This guy's here. Ron Weasley. Jennifer. Oh, wait. <laughs> My bad. Lot is her name. Get out of here before Mary comes. Quickly. Jennifer. I have a cage key. You didn't need to save me. She dead. Yeah. <laughs> Instantly died. A voice is heard outside the shed. Now, isn't that a pity? Oh, damn. Jennifer, don't move a muscle. I will punish you. I didn't move, though. I really wish I could get the stupid key off my screen. <laughs> oh, she's got a gun. Or a pipe. I can't tell. Jennifer, do not trouble me. I'll punish you. Well, you said you were going to punish me. Maybe then you'll be a nice, quiet child. Oh, I hope Dan Scissorman comes. What? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Oh. <laughs> <clears throat> I see. Here we go again. <laughs> like Groundhog's Day. Good thing I grabbed that ham. Hey, King. How's it going? Any hangover? No, I'm good. <laughs> was a fun night. Yeah, yeah, talking about the, the game. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. There's that, like, thing to the side there. Oh, okay. I had to talk to him twice. <sighs> yeah, I got to sync up with my group about that, King. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, no, I have to do that. I haven't done it yet. <laughs> stick, get the stick, get the stick. Snap. Aha. Uh -huh. Move the muscle. What you gonna do? Lap. Take the gun. Are you fucking kidding me? That <laughs> she knows how to use one, but uh, at a minimum, Miss Barry won't have it.
Oh, hey, it's that hole from before. What if I want to go this way, though? I'm gonna get shot, aren't I? <laughs> Probably gonna get shot. Going for the gun. She's gonna. Oh, yeah, she's just gone. Okay. <laughs> Wait, can I take that stick, though? Nope. One time use. Oh, he's just stuck here now. <laughs> no longer looking at Jennifer. Alright, what's off to the left, though? Also, where did what's-her-name Lot's cor corpse go? It's not there. Map. Look at this. That stick? I can't. No, no, no. Ah, oh, damn. I'll try, but I don't think I can. it like didn't highlight it or anything yeah it won't let me unless you mean not that stick or a different stick so that door just leads back that way which doesn't actually get us any progress although I think that other crack in the wall is gonna lead us towards the east wing so I'm guessing this gold key probably works on more than just, uh, the door I opened. Or I could go back to that room. Yeah, that's also an option. It's a deep crack in the wall, it's crumbling. Deep crack in the wall, it's crumbling. Oh, okay. That's not even an option to go in there. Got it. <laughs> like 100% that place I went to, though. Or, sorry, the other side of that... Uh, one room that I was looking for, uh, at. <clears throat> the thought running back and forth in this, uh, this room. <laughs> Be bad for my stress meter. So first I'm gonna check, oh, actually, I'm gonna go right back to the room that I was just in. It should be clear now. Uh-oh, I don't like the way this is, like, automatically doing stuff. No, I guess we're safe. I'm gonna rest up a bit, though. And at the risk of just flat-out dying, I'm gonna actually use this... <laughs> oh, wait, actually, let me make sure that she can rest, because right now she's not doing it. it only work on the second floor in this room? There we go. Okay. Anyway, I'll be right back. I'm just going to grab some water. So hang tight.
Okay. Credit card notice. Oh, it's just an ad. Thank goodness. <laughs> okay. Well, you don't need to just jet off, Jennifer. Jeez. <laughs> also, totally not the door I was trying to go into. Ah, she's not here now. So, Miss Mary intentionally led us all here. Kill us in some fashion or another. This one's different. Up black rub. Oh, I bet I need that for the sacrifice room. Ah, uh... uh. Wait, are they alive? <laughs> Laura was hiding in some armor. Oh wait, no, she's dead. <laughs> Seems to have been recently used. Yeah, by you. Some of the drink is still in there. Silver key is under the glass. Oh, wow. Okay. I'm glad I looked at that. Bet I should answer that. Various beverages. Phone line's been cut. That's <laughs> concerning, considering the situation. Or, considering that that phone's ringing. Okay, so that silver key is gonna open something. I'm gonna hope it's whatever's on the second floor of this area. Maybe just that phone line's been cut, and that ringing is actually coming from the room upstairs? But I guess we'll see. Eventually, anyway. Haunted phones, am I right? I know. <laughs> They're such a nuisance. I'm trying to sit here and solve a murder mystery slash cult thing. Meanwhile, you got these haunted, cursed phones just ringing off the hook. Oh, I did need a silver key for that. Okay. The heck is this room? Ah. <laughs> huh? It has chemical symbols on it. This is hard to understand. It covers the entire wall. Part of it's hidden behind the shelf. Well, perhaps I should move the shelf then. Nice. <laughs> oh my god. Fair enough. Thanks for not spoiling. <laughs> dot dot dot. Okay, well that doesn't help me understand anything any further, but... Cool. Like a... Rhino slash tiger. I almost want to call it a pegasus, but... It's got like a horse body, but that's like... It's not quite a rhino horn. That is like a tiger's tail. Or light lion sail, I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> Time will cause adherence. Okay, so same thing as the other room. Clock towers, clock stopped. Various chemicals are on the desk. That, that. Fix a ceremony. That room's somewhere in this house, yeah. I mean, I know where that room is. But 
I've got robes for the ceremony, but nothing else whatsoever. I probably need a crow. And then I don't know what the hell this thing is. Oh, cool. Some more notes and stuff. That's cool. Uh, so I don't... Uh, I don't know exactly where to go now. I guess I could go to the ceremonial room. Maybe stuff will be there. You go try to get that crow. I don't remember exactly where that room is, though. I think it's on the way to the ceremony room, or the ritual room. Uh, or at the very least, somewhere in that, like, back hallway on the west side. I could also try using my gold key in the other room, which might be more fruitful. I'm gonna try this other door over here first. As I wear out all of my stamina. Hopefully it's not wasting it for nothing. Locked. No. Well, there goes that. <laughs> now we're at orange stamina. Okay, let's rest up a little bit here. I feel like use chairs and stuff to rest faster. <laughs> also on that note, not sure what stamina really does for you other than I would imagine that probably gives you the uh, better prompt when you get attacked uh, so that you don't just auto die and you can actually resist. And then just other stuff like that I would I would guess. Oh, wait. Do I have anything that would help me solve the bird puzzle? Hope somehow work there? I don't think so. Unless I had to pull the box with a rope, but that's weird. <laughs> Maybe, I don't know. I don't really want to go all the way back there, though. Oh, well, I guess I am kind of going back there. If I have to go through, um... Yeah. Like, on my way to the ceremony room. Well, I'll go to the ceremony room first. Check that out. Still stumped after that. Which is plausible. <laughs> Likely, even. Wait, don't go in there. There's nothing, nothing useful in any of those rooms. I also don't remember where the... Uh, well, okay, no. The crow room is there. I don't know what I would do to get, like, the blood of that mythical creature that was on the wall. Or it's just like a normal creature and I can't <laughs> tell what it is. Anyway. Eh, I forget the stamina. Let's run. Uh, that's the doll room, or not the mannequin room, I think. Yep. <laughs> Literally a room just there for you to get ambushed. Cool.
Man, I was excited because I was making a ton of progress in a short amount of time. But then things very quickly screeched to a halt again. <laughs> Cradle room is what Simon was talking about. Oh yeah, that's right. He did mention that. Oh my god, I forgot entirely. Well, I think that's it's either upstairs in this area or it's like uh Yeah, that is upstairs. Or it's over here. But I, I need to check these rooms anyway, because one of these is the crow room. Oh yeah, this room. Looks like the one in the mural. Oh yeah, okay. So this thing is the you know, they were pouring like blood out of or whatever. Oh, there's already a uh Oh. Cradle under the star. Yeah, yeah. Something underneath here. Ha, huh, that's excellent wordplay. Just running. Uh, I... Yeah, no, that's the piano room. Okay, it is on the second floor. Where am I going? I'm going to the uh the cradle room. Oh, do I not need to actually go in there? I didn't mean to go in this side room over here. <laughs> oh. Or is it just a lot faster to go the other way because the stairs? Yeah, I... <laughs> Oops, well, we'll get there. Oh! I thought that was telling me to go over to this room. Or not this room, but the, the like baby's room with the cradle in it. I'm gonna go ahead and examine this again. <laughs> Out of shame. So I guess I just go there then? Okay, well, it said it had like a square hole though, so I thought I needed something to put in the hole. Do I have any? Thing. Yeah, not really. <laughs> well, first of all, run and speed this up a little bit. Oh, this is the fireplace room, or like the office. But this will lead me where I want to go. Wait a minute, this is no cradle at all. <laughs> Just a bed. Child's bed. Dirty with stains and dust. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Whoops. Sorry, everyone. <laughs> totally not the correct way to go. Unless. No, okay. Nothing new to inspect in here. Doing. No, oh, just leave. <laughs> That's the problem with these light switches that are in completely realistic locations. Keep flicking on them by accident. Wrong cradle anyway, you'll see why that's called the child's room. Or see why it's called that. Ah, neat. I never found that other dead crow room, but there is a dead crow in that room already, so. <laughs> yeah, 
Maybe we're all set. God, my navigation's terrible. Was it this room or the next one? I know, I guess we'll find out. Just go in here. <laughs> oh, that's the hallway down into here. Okay, yeah, it's the one to the right. I don't know why I can't <laughs> remember the layouts of things. <laughs> Fun times. Oh, right, it's not that door, because that door doesn't open, but it's the other door next to it. So, as a safety precaution, I'm actually going to, like, restore my stamina. A feeling some crazy stuff's going to happen. Once I get through this room. Uh, what are we doing? Okay, there we go. <laughs> Actually, I don't know if I can even rest in this room. We'll see. If I can't rest in here, then I'll just do the thing. Ooh. Any moment now. <laughs> Go ahead and rest. Alright, let's get on with this ceremony then. Okay. Okay, cool. Yeah, I, I don't know, I thought I had to set up all this stuff. I'm guessing I probably don't need to do this, but I'm doing it. Square hole is visible. Cradle under the star. Something underneath here. Okay, yeah, so I had to put something in that square hole. Uh... Perfume. No. <laughs> maybe the cage key? Or, maybe there's something in that vase over here. But I'm gonna try this key. Real, though. Okay. Figured that probably wouldn't work since it's like a square hole, but... Yeah, I, I think there's just one thing I gotta put in here. <laughs> but maybe it's in the room. Oh. <laughs> nice. Celadon vase. Okay. Still nothing special. Do, 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 do. Oh wait, maybe this thing. I don't have a statue. This is iron... Wait, hold on. Oh no. I don't even know where I would find such a thing. <laughs> there was a series of statues to the far right over here. But I don't think I could interact with any of them. Oh, maybe I get that out of the bird's nest. From the other room. Yeah, maybe it is time to try the rope on that box to try to... <laughs> on a second. What the hell? Because there's statues out here, but I'm assuming that... You probably mean a smaller one. <laughs> Rats scurry about in here. A single bird is left in the cage. What if I open up this part of the cage? Okay. <laughs> I 
Well. Sure did this. Find a way out of here too. <laughs> Bird is free. Rats ran away. Hanging at cor crow corpses. Been decapitated. Oh, I wonder if maybe there's something in this cage. It's empty. If I turn the lights on though. Because yeah, they were going apeshit when the lights were on. So now that they're not here, turn these lights on. Maybe we can find something? Nah, uh, it's just empty. Shoot. What a shame. So I'm thinking it's probably in that bird's nest in the other room. Um, maybe the rope can get me there? I don't actually know. <laughs> I don't really need to rest, because I'm just going to be running anyway, so who cares? <laughs> The stamina is doing me no good. Before I go all the way over there, I don't actually remember what's at the end of this hallway. Okay, bathroom. Oh, that that is just the end of the hallway. Gotcha. I kind of just assumed I'd be getting chased by the scissor man this entire game. Seems like that's more of an act one type thing. <laughs> Dipped. After I killed his brother. Probably the same guy. <laughs> Not actually dead. I'll eventually get there. <laughs> Gotta run through some halls here. Ah, uh, <laughs> there we go. Hmm. Trying to think of if there's any possible place. There is that crate in the prison room, the shed. Maybe... It wouldn't let me inspect it when I was in there, but it, like maybe it is in there? Whatever. I'm, I'm trying the uh, box thing first. And I'm not going to bother regenning my stamina because I already tried it with the uh, full stamina and it didn't do anything. Or it didn't change anything. God, those stairs. <laughs> All right, attempt number two. that box over here. I swear if she puts the rope in the box I'm going to inside. Guess I'll climb on it and then hop. What the hell? <laughs> Maybe I can push it with that stick. 
like a bird's nest. Oh wait, no, as soon as I click on the stick, she just pokes the thing. Oh! I had the solution all along. I have to inspect the nest first, then click on the box. Can I use stick now? I guess I don't need to. What is this? Nest is full of eggs and junk. That's what a nest is. Okay. How disappointing. <laughs> oh, I can't even go in here anymore. Oh wait, yes I can. Not that it matters, there's nothing over here, so... Wait, what's this? Oh! You can just get up there. No good too high to climb up. Oh, yeah, well, no. Oh, I'm not the biggest fan of that aspect of this game. <laughs> Aha! Oh. What? No. Doing. <laughs> Thought maybe there was something in there. Broken tableware. Okay, yeah, I think this room has been... I've already found like two key items in here. I doubt there's like another one, but... Since we were in the neighborhood. Oh, where else might I find a statue? Uh, let me go back in this room. This right here. I'm trying to think of every room I've been in so far. I don't think I've seen like a statue that she just ignored or anything. Nothing to say about any of that, huh? Oh wait, what if I turn the light off? I actually can't. <laughs> Fix a ceremony. That room's somewhere in this house. Yeah, we found it. Now what? <laughs> Various chemicals, the note. <coughs> What's my inventory? I have cage key, car key, rope, black robe, and perfume. I forget if there was a, another room in here before the hole. There is not. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'll give it a check. It's weird. Oh, yeah, maybe I just missed like a spot or two on it. I figured it's like gotta be... In one of the rooms I just opened, at least. Okay, there's that thing. Oh my gosh, that actually looks like it's, it could come off. There. But I can't highlight it at all. This is just the general, like, this is the mural. Somewhere in this house. One of these things? No. Uh, what about... Specifically the altar part. Yeah. Well,
haven't seen anything. Is this thing? That's... That's just a thing. You do mean on the wall, right? There might be some other step I have to do first before I know to, like, check this thing. That's, like, the weird, uh... Weird way this game works. <laughs> mm. Very odd. Indeed. Back to the search. Um, I'm gonna try going out into the courtyard again. I have a feeling that box might have something helpful in it. Oh, well actually, the other thing too, I could try go talking to um, the owner of the house. Whatever the hell his name is. That man that ate me. <laughs> Because he might elaborate on something. Maybe. Probably not. As stuck as I am, I'm actually really enjoying a lot of aspects of this. Simon doesn't have anything else? Okay, yeah. But, there's a box in that room. I'd like to search anyway. And actually just generally out here would be a good idea to look around. I kind of skimmed some of this, like this whole area. Oh. That pool definitely looks like it's from the drawing as well, but I think that's just like it opens a pit when you get the key in there, so it's similar. <laughs> Keep cracking the wall, it's crumbling. Um, let's find stuff. No, this box has nothing to offer. It's so weird, though. Wait, is that a statue? No, I definitely tried to click on that thing when I was in here, so... <laughs> that can't be the thing I need. <laughs> uh, absolute caveman picture there. He's got no stress though, he's blue. <laughs> that box is a beginner's trap. Oh, do you like try to mess with the box? That's funny. <laughs> nice. I definitely don't regret all the things I've like screwed up so far, because it's kind of funny. <laughs> the really deaths you can run into. Well, where else might I find this? Oh my god. Excuse me. Oh, 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 oh. There's a... Uh, I don't know that I fully explored some of the starting area stuff. It could be in one of those rooms. When Mary comes to kill you, if you hide in the box, she shoots the box. <laughs> uh, that's great. She's like, yeah, I know you're in here. <laughs> um, yeah, okay, so I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna try looking through these like rooms from the start, because I don't think I looked at all of them completely, or as completely as I could have.
This is the bathroom, though, which I don't need to be in. Damn it. Oh my goodness. Can't stop yawning. <laughs> So this bird will just kill me. Not opening that thing. Okay. Looks like the left bed isn't used, etc., etc. Et I'm pretty sure this mirror will kill me. Wait, let me examine this photo again. Maybe that has some useful info. Is this? Yeah, well. <laughs> Time for a hair check. Okay. Wrap the bird in a blanket? Really? I'll try. I didn't realize I had time to do anything when this happened. Kind of seemed like I just died. <laughs> Yeah, no, she, she just walks in the center of the room and dies. <laughs> Excellent. Gotta be really careful not to hit game start by accident. <laughs> Maybe I use the robe on him. Oh, I see. What? Oh no. Oh, he chases you and you hide near the bird around at your location. Good. <laughs> like it works, don't know why it didn't hear unless you were on too poor health. Yeah, oh, yeah. That's probably it. Seems like a Game Shark cheat just lets me go back to full stamina. Can I rest in here? Okay, you don't need to walk that far. <laughs> let's find out. I should be able to. It's a bedroom. It's fully lit. Just let that up for a second. Getting there. <laughs> yeah, so I'm, I'm guessing that, um, yeah, this other bed looks like it's just not fitted with anything currently. I'm also going to cheat save state so I don't have to, like, <laughs> if I heal up and then, uh, die anyway, <laughs> I don't want to have to, like, sit and get all of my stamina. Actually, no, I can I do that by just leaving the room and coming back in. But whatever. Wouldn't hurt to save. Plus, I can set that up now while the healing's happening. Alright. Full health. Let's do this. Go, bird. Got nothing on me. Hmm. What if I just do this, though? 
blanket. That blanket. Oh, I see you gotta be able to take one hit at least. It's the blanket. Oh, there we go. <laughs> nothing in there. No. It's like the left bed isn't you. We're not going to talk about the bird you just smothered. <laughs> okay. Wait. All right. Well, this room has nothing, it seems. Yes, yeah, so that's probably just to stop it from ratting you out. Oh, uh, it's trying to hide from Bobby. Well, there's definitely options in here. So you got a free hiding spot? True. <laughs> Granted, we haven't seen Bobby in 10 million years, but <laughs> I'm not complaining. Yeah, so I can't examine that at all, it looks like. We already examined that. Be out of it. <laughs> there we go. Static. The atmosphere, right? Sphere for fear. Or maybe it's not over here. Huh. <laughs> yeah, that's gotta be like the ROM glitching. <laughs> that's not normal. And then only shows up when he triggers. Uh, unlike the sequel, we can spawn over time too. Nice. You know, that's, that's the way to do it. Have yourself never actually be safe. <laughs> And this is just the main hall again, right? Uh, yeah. No statues. Wait a minute. I think I know something. Wait, no, never mind. I was thinking that you might be able to run across this gap if you have full stamina. Or not run across it, but run jump. <laughs> Jump with a running start. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Hit my glass. Hatching over 500 plus Pokemon eggs for a certain one with a great nature hidden ability. Sounds like a grind. <laughs> not, not my bag. Why did I go down to red health immediately? <laughs> what the hell? Alright, here we go time on jackass <laughs> yeah okay now the question is do I cheat <laughs> and just look it up because I'm completely lost I have no idea where that could be Also, I can't heal in this room for some reason. Maybe not? Check out, uh, Meru. I don't know what that one is. Another good, uh, 
horror game that's on Steam is uh Detention. Kramer. Got a demo too. Story driven psychological horror. Good start. Uh the screenshots and the video is not loading for me. Awesome. Put it on my wish list and look at it later. <laughs> Oh, Straylight? Yeah, no, totally. Buy Straylight. I'm considering maybe, I, I don't know what the rest of the group feels like, but I would totally love to make a horror game. Uh, I think we're sticking with VR stuff, though, so. <laughs> I need to check out the doll room. Oh, yeah, I never found a single thing in there. That actually kind of makes sense. Yeah, I don't think I can cross this gap. Waiting to just charge up my strength there. See if by any chance it would have like changed. <laughs> Granted, I could go to max health, but I don't think it's going to change anything. <laughs> Damn staircase that just takes all your stamina. That's actually the perfect place to hide a statue, too. I mean, I know it's a small statue, but... Like, at that point, or at this point, there's, like, that's one potential place, because I've... Like, there's really no other point of being in there. Noted. <laughs> Will do. I kind of assume that if he didn't trigger on that, he's not going to, but... Might be wrong. Um, I forgot. I lost my train of thought. Oh yeah, just making games. Don't know. <laughs> Need to do that. Yeah. Well, more importantly, before I think about what next game I'm making, I should uh, get my current one out of early access. <laughs> and yet here I am streaming instead of working on my game. Painful. I might actually do a stream uh, where I do some like level design sometime. I don't really want to like code and stream because that doesn't. I don't know. There's there's a lot of like technical problems I have with that. Of <laughs> just how to best stream that because I'm usually flipping between like sixteen different things when I'm coding. Like tabs of like how do I do this thing or like working on the calculation if it's something math related. Anyway, sorry, I just want to have a tangent. <laughs> For anyone that's not aware, uh, I also do some game development in my spare time. But that was probably incredibly apparent <laughs> from, uh... Oh shit, there is something in there, but also I need to rest. Actually, related to the topic of VR, though, I have not played a ton of VR horror games. Sadly, I have can't play uh, Resident Evil 7 in VR because I don't have the stupid PSVR. Although, I think there's like a mod that might work for PC, but I've never looked into that. Pretty sure that's Bobby. Oh, yeah, that would make sense. Jennifer, are you going to rest or just hang out here? Oh, <laughs> yeah, sure, just keep walking. There we go. It's so bizarre. Like, once you enter a door, you can't rest. You have to move first. But, uh, yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm sure there's plenty of horror games out there in VR because a lot of VR games are indie titles and a lot of indie developers tend to <clears throat> drift towards horror. It's, that's a really weird generalization. Totally not true. But, <laughs> I don't know. Boneworks is amazing, dude. Love that game. I actually haven't finished it. I haven't finished that or Half-Life Alex. Half-Life Alex, I guess, I think it's classified as a horror game under someone's definition. <laughs> but, <laughs> yeah, no. Those are both really good games, though. I played Resi 7 in VR once, somehow made it to where Ethan is 7 feet tall. <laughs> yeah, uh, I can tell you firsthand, height calibration is 
hilarious and complicated. Okay, for full health, let's do this. My game, you don't even like, we don't even render like a body, so you don't need to uh, do any complicated stuff with that. Oh, I can rest in here. Wasn't that nice? By the way, for any Resident Evil fans, or not, actually, because it's kind of a meme, so it's worth checking out. Um, Capcom released a survey uh, related to the Resident Evil 8 stuff that's like out there right now, um, just to get like feedback. And uh, first off, I would like super recommend if you like, I don't know, want to give them input on where you think the series should go or what you're like looking for in the games. Um, it seems like they're trying to be better about getting that kind of stuff. Um, but also, just in general, like, there's some hilarious questions on that thing. For example, uh, does the title Resident Evil Village make you think that this game is going to take place in the village? Strongly agree. Agree. Neither agree nor disagree. Disagree or strongly disagree. <laughs> That's got to be Bobby, right? Following around back there, Bobby. How do I get back there? Super lost in this room. I <laughs> at this point, I want him to attack. Yet, won't. So that's either Bobby. Or thing I need. <laughs> Either way. Clearly missing something here. Room, don't leave the room. No, you left the room. Hang it. How do I do this? Come on, come on. What the hell? If you don't want to come out, just let him fiddle still. <laughs> I guess. I, I just want to know how this trap's supposed to work. Like, that makes me think that there is something that's in this room that I need, and I'm just not getting to the positioning of it. Because if I can't even, like, set off his trigger, like I, like, I don't know, like, should I be able to get in the back half of this room? All right, Eaton. Big way. Sorry, not doll room. Mannequin. Can't spell mannequin. Or you never need to go in there. What room is this? Go 
trophy room? No, that's not. Nothing in this room, I think. Oh, I see what you're saying. Like, I feel like that one that's shaking is probably <laughs> his, uh... Oh, that's the garage. Okay, so that's this side. So this hallway should lead to... Oh yeah, maybe he's just broken because it's like, uh... Set up that way. Maybe it is the trophy room. Doesn't seem like it would be called that. <laughs> it's like I have this door, and there's the staircase. Yeah, I, that is the trophy room. Oh, okay. Sometimes it trades places with the mannequin room. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, okay. Looked it up. You're correct. Nothing in here. <laughs> uh, I did pass the trigger already. Those things that are moving are not Bobby. That's just... That's just how they are. Uh, I didn't look up where the statue is, though, which I think I might actually want to do, because I have no idea where I'm going now. <laughs> that leads me back. Um, the doll room. What? What doll room? Oh, 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 like the child's room? Hold on, let me just waste all my stamina really quick. <laughs> it's another haunting, yeah, yeah. Nothing to do with the scissor man. This is the cage room, right? Still going strong? Yeah. Pretty much. Thinking about cheating right now. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I need to do something that I know is going to happen. It's going to be funny. It might kill me. Oh, no, I'm, I'm at yellow. I'll be fine. Probably. Okay, yeah. I'll check that out in a moment. First, I need to do this. Get some more light in this room. Pull the curtains back. Oh, wait a minute. Holy crap. Aha! <laughs> uh, I think that's what I need. So, in the uh, playthrough... That I saw like a piece of. Uh, he was hiding behind that curtain. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but it's randomized. <laughs> oh, I love it. Yeah, that makes sense. The vase was in the painting. I needed to find that. Yeah, use the thing. Right all under the star. Yep. Something underneath here. Her hole is visible. Yeah, use. Okay, I guess this isn't what I use for that. Maybe I put it in this vase, though? Or I put it in the, uh, this thing. I don't know. I guess we'll see when it happens. Yes! What was that sound? Oh, hey! Doing it. Hole goes pretty far down. I can descend with this ladder here. Okay. Kinda looks like she just dropped herself in, but okay. Oh my god. Stay at yellow health. Be okay. 
I don't like that sound. <laughs> right, right. Oh, I should put my robe on. That way that dog won't maul me. Oh, fuck the statue. <laughs> Wish I knew how to put this robe on. Something's there. Yeah. Sounds like a dog. Use your freaking robes. There we go. Okay. Hey, buddy. Oh, perfume. Ah. Dog knows the smell very well. Perfume Mary used. Still mad, though. Get killed? <laughs> what? <laughs> Two feet away from that dog, now we're f perfectly safe. This part's stupid, you gotta use the robe and the perf- Yeah, <laughs> I got it. Oh god. <laughs> A maze. Wandering around in caves. Go in here? No, you're not. Maybe it opens later. Oh, the candles mark the doors. That's nice. Good to know. Oh! But that works with the elevator. Except, uh, I can't operate on it. Okay. Approaching the cradle. Can here. Looks like kerosene. Okay. Kerosene. Keto. Never mind, those candles are just haphazardly placed. <laughs> oh snap. What's gonna happen? It could run just a little. <laughs> I just fucking drop off this clip. Oh, there's a thing down there. <laughs> Snap. I don't I don't wanna. <laughs> I also know what's behind here, although I guess I haven't seen it. <laughs> Bye. Oh no, it's coming. Oh lord, he coming. Go Jennifer, go. Don't trip! Oh! Wrong button! <laughs> did, I, did I die? Okay. <laughs> oh no! Hit yeah, go! I forgot if it's B or A that I have to jam. I'll just hit in both of them. No! <laughs> Ugh. Ug. Okay. Button mash thing is gone now. Oh, mama. That is Dan. Oh. Oh, thank God that just spontaneously combusted. Well, bye, Dan. Ah, <laughs> uh ah. -uh. Ah, uh ah, -uh. ah. <laughs> Boom. Killed them both. Both of them, scissor mans. Open this door is open. <laughs> if it's not, we're gonna have some problems. 
Oh, good, I pressed this now. Big ol' baby and just disturbed his cradle and set him on fire. <laughs> Pretty rude, TBH. Third floor. Get away. Oh no! I thought, I thought Scissor Man was going to come in through the, the grate there. Oh, he is! Haha, <laughs> too bad you can't climb ladders. Oh man, I should have thrown an awesome one-liner like, bitch can't even swim. Something. <laughs> Pull them levers. Oh! Oh! Yeah, buddy. Take that, scissor man. <laughs> well, it feels like an ending to me. My adopted daughter, you. I will kill you. No. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. <laughs> Control panels will just straight up electrocute you when you touch them. <laughs> Jennifer is incredibly chill about all of this. So I'm betting that statue is related to the other ending. Probably other stuff I could have done down in that cave as well. Included indeed. Alright, that was a ton of fun. I'll wait for the outro here. <laughs> She's like, I'm done with this shit. <laughs> yeah, it's like I just killed like a monster, sorry, a giant monster, a tiny monster, and an evil woman. Jeez. Oh, the statue's from the sequel, nice, okay. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Well, I should be back on uh, later tonight uh, to stream some D, which will probably be pretty short, so I'm going to throw some other game in there, like uh, maybe Granny, I don't know, <laughs> kind of ruins the whole motif of uh, Boomer Horror Month, but uh, keep streaming. No, I actually have to go right now. It's dinner time. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, <laughs> no lol. Yeah, it sucks, because I was going to just, like, do a stream of, like, this and then stream D after it, um, but, uh, yeah, like I said, I had plumbing issues earlier today, and I'd take care of that, um, I got a late start, but, what can you do? Part owner in a house. All those hauntings were from that giant baby. Damn, I'm glad I set that baby on fire. <laughs> I don't know, oh, I guess maybe if I examined the mirror when the lights were off, I would have got choked out by it, because I know you can get strangled, um, if you do that, <laughs> but with the light on, you just kind of check your hair and everything's fine. There's like only like two or like three songs in here, but really effective music. And has spooky powers and assists his brother in scaring slash killing people. It's cool. And there's also, like, seems to be a, a cultish society <laughs> worshipping them in this mansion. Or, or just the one lady. Hard to say. 
brings these orphans in. Oh, okay. I guess I just got lucky. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> cool. Well, y'all, thanks for hanging out. If you want to see some more horror, drop a follow, or just hang out, whatever. Uh, otherwise, yeah, I'll be back later tonight with D as well as a uh, bonus mystery game, TBD. Uh, and then uh, tomorrow I'll be streaming Phantasmagoria. I'm going to try to just one-shot that as well. But yeah. Thanks for hanging out. I've said that like eight times now. But uh, yeah. Take care. Have a wonderful night. And or see you later tonight. But peace. Ooh. Nice. Lore. Yeah, I'm sure I'll get more of that as I play the other games. <laughs> Well, I'm out. Bye, everybody.